a short walk in the park after the lunch. Oh yeah, there's a standing Buddha. I was thinking about to come. And there is a Buddha Dodama. First one, first mantra, and second paragraph is mantra, and second paragraph is antakshi. Antakshi. Yeah. There is no girls, no. So that's because it's just like a music beat mode. If if there will be girls, then you will you will sing nicely and slowly. Good. This simply put on. We use maize corn out here, even uh, rice to make a flower. Yeah. This is red red, 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 red. You can give some try? Yes, yeah, we have tried. Already? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, the next out here then. Yeah. Sir? So here, this is uh, known as a uh, hot stone bath, traditional hot stone bath. Oh. So it's the same like taking steam bath or a traditional method of taking spa, sauna bath. So here we have to collect the rocks from the riverside okay. and we have to burn it around six to seven hours. And then we have water, lot of fill it with water. And here we have to fill with cold water. So this cold water and heated rocks will contract each other and definitely the water will get warm. Oh, so if you take wonderful. bath in this warm water, your joints pain and the body pain will be cured. So you can give some try after your torrent. <laughs> Uh, butter tea and uh, uh, why, uh, rice. That's a burger. Burger.
In Bhutan, simplest, cheapest and purest form of offering to God, Buddha, by human beings is pure water. We need not spend uh, lots of money, gold, silver or anything. Just put a glass of water in front of him, he will be very much pleased. After hitting the target, pressing like this. <laughs> they use this kind of tools. So we call this suja in our town and it is our traditional tea. So here in order to make a butter tea, we usually include four ingredients like butter, salt, hot water and tea leaves. So all the ingredients we put here, we just chant for 14 to 15 minutes, but we need more energy to people like a gentleman to have a good taste. So here this one is our traditional noodles maker. Yes, okay. noodles. Yeah. We make a dough, we put there, we need to just freeze it. We'll carry the noodles from the outside. Yeah. So here this one is sure, yeah. You know already you learn about this? <laughs> you learn from it? History means what I use. History! history. history. You learn this? Uh, and then, then small bowls come. Chai. Oh, okay. You mean this one? For chai? This one? Oh, he learned everything. He knows everything. <laughs> so here this one is our traditional plate. We call this dapa or it is a couple plate. So like a like a husband and wife they can take this kind of plate and have a food here. So uh, we call this dapa and it's couple plate. So in the ancient days our grandparents so after finish eating food and all said if they wash again and again. So they love an eviction. Which country here will be fair away together? So for that reason they never uh, wash it, just lick it and wipe it. So here uh, another reason is, uh, those people like crack and damages, therefore they never wash it, they just lick it and wipe it. But nowadays if you see this kind of plate, if you want it to purchase, you will see very clean one, like polish one and washable one. <laughs> So a thousand times you can watch it, never damage. <laughs> traditional jack. Traditional jack to pour the water. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Even they make a whole day to drink it, but our mother uses it's a weapon to beat us in the porridge. Yeah. So here this one is our tea stainer. Oh, tea stainer. Yeah, tea stainer. And these are the earthen pots. And even we have the ventilation process and we have a traditional gas oven. Yeah. We call it tap. We make a fuchula. wooden uh, wood, We make wood. wood. Uh, yeah. With the fire of fire, uh, firewood. Wood, wood. And so they were like. Yeah. So these are the ones we take out up there to, protect, uh, like, to make it stronger and harder. Yeah. We have to put their sand. Yeah, 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 sure. So sure, too. Sure, sure. You know everything. <laughs> Just you be a guide to us. The King's Kitchen in. You are using, using yeah, yeah, yeah. You mean like we are using nowadays, right? Yeah. So yeah, we are still using, but mostly modern facilities, sir. Much we using gas. Must be sure, sure gas, yeah. <laughs> but uh, when yeah, if, no, no, chai, to make second November two thousand nineteen on the way to Punaka from Tepo. You have to take separate permit to visit Punaka. So, so give it a permit, sir. So we sing a song. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yes, sir. 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 Right hand of. Right hand of. Home Minister. Indian Home Minister. Right hand of Modi ji. Right hand of Modi. He is Amit Shah. The sun is clear. I mean. The uh, sky is clear, we may be able to see some uh, Himalayan mountains, 180 degree view. So this is horse, uh, this one. Yeah, horse, this is a horse. Yeah, coming.
This is Dochala Pass. Last month, one Indian fellow from Maharashtra climbed the top of this uh, stupa and he was arrested. Today being a clear sky, you can see the Himalayas, very beautiful Himalayas. One hundred and eight stupas here. Just like any Indian number, one zero eight is also considered auspicious here. Oh, beautiful. Very nice place, very nice weather. A little bit chilly. You have to pay extra hundred rupees to come here to this viewpoint. Cool.